So we're here uh, at the, the Swedish waxing truck where uh, everyone is, uh, the servicemen are preparing the skis. They will try and uh, narrow down how many skis they test then tomorrow before the, uh, the competition begins. We have uh, 10 working station and uh, we are, uh, when we are full service team, we are 13 guys, some working inside here. So some guys working with the grip wax and some working with the with the glide and uh, the other works with the uh, athlete skis. So we have eight service guys uh, working with, uh, with the athletes. So more if we take Mickey here, he have uh, three athletes, one girl and one sprint guy and one distance guy. So we have uh, that plan we have uh, for, for the serviceman. Uh, now we're cleaning the skis and uh, packing with the uh, packing wax. Yeah. yeah. So they are ready for tomorrow's uh, competition or for a new test. Uh, we have space here uh, in the in the box, so we have uh, 680 pair, and then we have uh, maybe 50 test pair. So around just over 700 pair skis in uh, in this uh, track. Yeah, after you've worked with your ski tech for a few years, you almost kind of develop this, this unspoken understanding. Um, yeah, they definitely know our skis really well, and when we go out, we can almost take a look at each other's faces and know kind of what the feeling is. So it's great to have someone who can, uh, can feel the skis like you do so that you can get as close as you uh, to the optimal thing by race day. We understand each other, so we, we know what, what, it, what the problem is. Is it, uh, is it just the conditions, you know, or uh, is it... Uh, do we need to do something else with the skis or I mean to me she's a really good friend <laughs> also when things go great I'm super happy and when things go not so great it's always uh, I mean it's a it's a big <laughs> big <laughs> pain <laughs> but at the end the athlete has to make decision because he had to ski we're just here to support him and ski with him and, and say yeah I, I agree I disagree or and then we go back for sure to the wax techs because they know their skis way better than I do. But uh, yeah, I, I feel also a little bit in my feet something. Sometimes, not, they, not every day, but today it's pretty good. And if the athlete says, oh, that pair is really fast, you say, uh, yes, they are. Yes, then, then, <laughs> then, then, then we confirm this. So uh, that is probably smart, not <laughs> so start again. <laughs> Yeah, it really depends on the day or how my mood is, but we are almost, yeah, we are always going together, but at some days I don't feel anything and some days I have a good feeling, so then I trust more to my service man. Do you always have good skis then on your good and your bad days? <laughs> <laughs> you have to ask my service man. Okay. <laughs>